Hey kids, today we'll be learning about plants. Are you ready? Let's begin. What are plants? Plants are living organisms that cover much of the land of planet Earth. Plants are members of the kingdom Plantae. You see them everywhere. Examples are grass, trees, flowers, bushes, ferns, mosses, and more. What makes a plant a plant? Here are some examples of plant characteristics. Plants have a cuticle, a waxy layer under surface that protects them and keeps them from drying out. They reproduce with spores or with sex cells. Most plants make their own food through a process called photosynthesis. One of the most important functions of most plants is photosynthesis. Plants use photosynthesis to create energy directly from sunlight. The Basic Structure of Plants The three basic parts of most vascular plants are the leaf, the stem, and the roots. Let's start with the leaf. The leaf is an organ of a plant that is specialized for photosynthesis. Leaves capture energy from sunlight as well as collect carbon dioxide from the air. Leaves come in many different shapes and sizes. Next would be the stem. The stem is the main structure that supports leaves and flowers. Stems have vascular tissues that move food and water around the plant to help it grow. Plants often store food in their stems. Finally, roots. The roots of a plant grow underground. Roots help to keep the plant from falling over and gather water and minerals from the soil. Some plants store food in the roots. The two major types of roots are fibrous roots and tap roots. Tap roots tend to have one major root that grows very deep, while fibrous roots have many roots that grow in all directions. Let's take a closer look at the plant cell. Plant cells are composed of rigid cell walls made of cellulose, chloroplast, a nucleus, and large vacuoles filled with water. Here are fun facts about plants. The fastest growing woody plant in the world is the bamboo. Bamboos can grow up to 35 inches in just one day. Fungi and algae are not considered plants, but are part of their own kingdoms. There are nearly 600 different species of carnivorous plants that actually eat insects and small animals. The largest flower in the world is the Rafflesia, which can grow to over 3 feet in diameter. And that is all for today's lesson about plants. I do hope you enjoyed today's video. See you soon! Bye-bye! If you enjoyed the video and want to see more videos from us, please click the subscribe button. Also, give us a like. That will help us. We thank you so much and we do hope that you enjoy our videos. See you soon!